everyone. So today we're looking at uh, ways that you can be scammed um, in hardcore and just how to how to really avoid that. Um, I've got a, a couple of things that are really, really common that I just wanted to uh, to show you today. So the first one um, is just on the auction house. Um, it's when you're using the default UI of the auction house. So you can see when you're, if you search for something like a Vesta Magic one, for example, you can see people are actually posting things that are one copper bid price, but then they're actually posting them really high um, for the for the buyout price there. That's in order to try and um, get people to you know to, to click on them and choose the wrong ones. You can see one here is at five silver fifty five, but was at fifty one gold. Um, which is completely ridiculous. I've actually, back in TPC Classic, I actually bought, I think it was Eternal Life for about 800 gold accidentally. So um, I know that horrible feeling when you do it. So I just wanted to um, show everyone really just how how common this is. You can see it's on a whole, um, a whole array of things. Uh, the best way to avoid it is um, Blizzard actually put into the, the Classic UI an option to, to sort like the, the auction house now. It's, it's fairly new for Classic to have the price sorting options. Um, unfortunately, the price um, defaults to current bid um, in the sort in. So all you need to do is press that little cogwheel at the top and then change that to sort it by buyout. And then that will actually solve your problem there. And that will mean that you don't um, see the ones with the low bid price first. Um, I always sort things by buyout anyway, so you can yeah, if you have a look, you can you can see that there. Um, it really does solve the it really does solve the problem. Um, this the other thing, the other handy thing that this um, does is actually if you look at the the cog options, rather than going by total price, um, you can change that to unit price, which means when you're looking for something on the auction house, you can um, see that. Uh, so you see there, you can see the the whole stack of twenty linen cloth. You don't have to go all the way down page after page after page after page. You can see them on the first page if they're cheaper by unit. So that is another one that is really good. You can see even on uh, linen cloth there, there is um, you know a whole a whole load of them that are at one copper, but they're at like nine silver buyout. It's completely ridiculous. Um, generally, if you use any add-ons, so if you use TSM or you use Auctionator, the add-ons are all able to sort things correctly. Um, but unfortunately, even though Blizzard did go to the trouble of putting it into the UI so that you can sort things, they haven't actually made those the default settings. So you you still need to change it yourself. I do recommend using um, I do recommend using an add-on like Auctionator. That's the one that I use uh, for for buying things anyway. Um, that as you can see here, that lays it out really really nicely, and it just yeah it it makes it really really simple. Um, so yeah, I would definitely recommend um, downloading an add-on for, for the auction house if you haven't already. But if you're not wanting to use the um, use add-ons, then just go with um, changing the, the default settings. So the second one then is um, a little bit less common, but um, it's still happening uh, more and more in hardcore. So this one is um, people sending you items um, in the mail by cash on delivery. So what will happen, um, you'll receive a mail in your mailbox and it will have a, have a price attached basically. It's, it's aiming for you just to take the item out of the mail without thinking about it. And then it automatically sends them the gold. Um, the sort of the the whole scam usually goes you see somebody in trade and they're selling something at a really good price it'll be something um i'm using um crusader orbs as, a, as an example here so you'll see them selling crusader orbs at a really good price and then they'll say that they'll send them to you cash on delivery so cod um, but what they'll actually do is send you four of something or however many of something that looks exactly like crusader orb um, for the for the price and then you'll open the mail thinking that you're getting your item and you're actually getting um, in this case smaller lustrous pearls 
the way around that is really just to, to check and look at things before you take them out of your mail. Um, it's an easy enough one to avoid. Um, but yeah, just, just be aware, basically. Um, it's not that common, but it is happening more and more. So just think about it before you do take something out of your mail from someone you don't know. So I hope you found this uh, useful. Um, if you did, then please do um, take a moment to press subscribe. I would really, really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.